guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 3 of Feeling Good, Pretty Curious. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. That's a little too bright. Oh my god. Sun? I mean, seriously. How can you be so sure about that, though? Whoever voices her, oh my god. <laughs> so cute. She's just like a little obsessed fan, and that's okay. I mean, she's just really really in love with our bad guy. My freaking child, oh my god. Are you gonna make me cry again today? I feel like this show gonna make me cry again. I have no tissues, so um don't make me cry again today. <laughs> Let's not do three for three. <laughs> but I feel like there's gonna be something that's gonna make me either tear up or just be like mm -hmm. Uh <laughs> No. Mhm. Mm Cut secret. Oh. <laughs> So adorable. Oh. 
Latte? Uh. Latte would go to school. Like, oh, no, don't get scared. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh God. I found your dog. It's a secret. No. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> Don't worry, she's okay. Oh, you. oh, don't worry, you'll see him by the end of the episode. <laughs> Oh, so you're like, what's her face from Persona 4 in a way? Well, I kind of think it's obvious what she's going to be when she grows up. So he feels useless. Here she comes. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
Oh, and it's a wild one, too. It's so cute. Oh, my God. That's so mean. Uh, but, but you got... You, you forgot. You forgot. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> it honestly looks like toxic water you know how like if any of you have seen oh my god it's one of the horror movies uh i think it no cabin fever there we go it looks like that water, and then like, you know, it kind of looks like regular water, and then people drink it and they get sick. Yeah, I know. I'm a little sorry to introduce a horror movie in a pretty cure episode, but hey, I mean, that's just me. I honestly thought she was going to fight her right then and there. But like, oh, we about to do something different now. No. Mm -hmm. Our little clumsy. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need to. I know we're getting close to the part which she's not going to yeah. Mm -hmm. There we go. Yes, you can. 
my god. You're so precious. Mm -hmm. Gotta try. No. Yes, you can. You shown just like Mabby me. What? Well, it's mm -hmm, that, and it's all over your face too. I'm kind of, yeah, I'm getting a little mermaid vibes. Mm -hmm. Care mermaid. <laughs> oh my gosh, she can die. Oh my gosh. Too pretty, though. Very pretty. Mm -hmm. 
so cute. Oh my god. <laughs> uh -huh. Everything was fine. Perfect. It's okay. <laughs> No, uh -huh. looking for his owner. <laughs> God, it's so adorable. Now, the biggest thing that I'm wondering with, like, Neon, we got, okay, if Ravi is more of flowers, Penguinton is more water because of the penguin, of course. What the heck is gonna attract a cat? Fish? Is it gonna be food? Like, because that's all I can think. A cat hungry? It's food? <laughs> I don't know. We ain't gonna know until next week. But this is a really good episode. I like Chi Yu. She's very interesting. She does give me feels to um, Yukari from Persona 4. Yukari or y Yuki Yukiko. Yukiko from Persona 4 because of the fact that she lives in it and she wants to take care of the end. And it seems like the way her, her thing of what she's going to want to do for when she's a grown up, it's already set in motion in this episode. So my guess is, unless we get something else for her, um, when she gets older by the end of the series, she's going to be working at the end and she's going to own it. Kind of the traditional thing, I've seen it with Persona 4, where whoever is next in line, they are running the end from the point of this until they die and then their kids, so on and so forth. It could be like that. I'm not 100% sure, but yeah. Her transformation was cute too. Gave me like a lot of Cure Mermaid vibes. <laughs> it's A. Because B doesn't have the teeth. <laughs> I mean, that one was just obvious. <laughs> I think if they had, like, four pictures, <laughs> then, yeah, it would be a little different. Okay. But, yeah, I mean, the episode was nice and everything. It was different. I'm glad that, you know, she got to get some character development from the last episode going into this episode. And her and being a pen, they look so cute together. I'm, like, mm, I can't. Like, it's too many feels. Like I said, the transformation gave me Cure Mermaid vibes. Um, you would think, like, with the coat that they're wearing before they transform perennially into their outfits, that it's like, okay, she's going to be a doctor type. Because I've said this before and I'll say it again. Usually, always, the blue cure is always the one who goes into a medical field type. Or whether it's a doctor or a veterinarian or something. Except what's the first one? Could it get a pretty girl in mode? She was kind of different because she was like, Eh, I'm gonna be a rock star, and that was good. I was just like, okay. And same thing with Watch Your Face from um, Heart Catch, mm -hmm. fashion designer. And then I think with um, yeah, Lala. And then what was her name? 
Saya from Hagato. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, it, it was just good. Okay, so let's just go ahead and talk about the next preview real quick. All right, so we got to take a latte to the animal hospital. Okay, here's my thing. You, you're showing me a cute guy. I'm ready. I just want next Sunday to come and stuff. I mean, we've already technically, we're only three episodes and we're about to be in four next week. And we've seen maybe like one or two cute guys in the show already. But I mean, we're, go we're going to an animal hospital. And I mean, it's just going to be so interesting to just see what all they're going to do, especially in an anime. Because as someone who's also been to an anime hospital, anime, animal hospital, of course, so whether it's for my dogs or whatever, or just anything with a friend or a family member, just to see some animals and just seeing like, oh, how they're getting taken care of and stuff. It's really interesting. Different, but interesting. Because, you know, when you go to the hospital, a regular hospital, and you get to see how a person is being taken care of. But then when you see an animal, it's completely different. And it's just, it's interesting. Even though that's not really my forte, it's still interesting to just see it, you know. But yeah, other than that, guys, that was my reaction to Futuro's episode 3 of Can We Go Pretty Here. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys, especially all next Sunday, for episode 4. Bye, guys.